Hello my dear listeners my name is Kishor Ganesh and in this episode of the Vocal About Visuals podcast i will be reviewing a brand new netflix anime series Tekken Bloodline Tekken Bloodline should have been a movie instead it has been stretched to 6 ep- of around 25 minutes each with so much filler and repetition that it would have put Dragon Ball Z's Raditz Saga to shame. Remember those episodes where Piccolo would power up a special beam cannon for three episodes or something? Ah, childhood memories. But yes, here in Tekken, all they had for a plot was the coming of age story of Jin. Only thing is, he comes of age by basically fighting and training all through his puberty. to take part in a tournament when he's on the cusp of adulthood this is a reasonable if a very templated plot for a film but a mini series sheesh throughout the series our hero keeps remembering his mother and grandfather so many times that you end up wondering how exactly is he living every moment these overwhelming and repetitive thoughts are i am assuming used to show the conflict in the paths that's presented to him but my god have they overdone it in fact this taken anime has fights cut out to focus on dialogues and the hero's thoughts i mean is this series supposed to be a coherent edit of the cut scenes of the video game but all this said the series itself i think had the potential to be quite decent had they invested in building this world out a bit or even a lot more and if that was not possible i have an easier way out take the same series and cut it into a movie sort of a reverse snyder cut so are there good parts to this anime i would say yes even if tekken slash video games are on the periphery of your universe seeing someone like king a mexican wrestler with a jaguar head slash mask or paul phoenix the dude with the 2 feet high blonde hair or nina williams the sexy female assassin is bound to inspire some kind of recognition if not a sense of quote and quote oh this is so cool seeing these iconic characters in anime format is i'm not going to lie quite cool but the parts are insanely cut short with the show more focused on the michima family drama and surprisingly even the family drama as cliched as it was was fleshed out well to a certain extent but that's about where the good parts end for me so if you were to ask me if you should take time out and watch this with all your attention i would say no instead i would suggest you watch this like how i did half sleep or in between chores that will do audience that will do once again my name is kishor ganesh this is the vocal about visuals podcast and thank you my dear listeners for your time and for listening Please do give this podcast a follow on your preferred podcast platforms and on YouTube. Please follow me on my socials at Podcast Plural. Thank you.